What's going on guys? You already know it's your boy M to the A to the C to the K A Y vibes. I'm back with another video as you can see guys, you know, I'm wearing the African Yoruba hat and the cap de fila. I they give you guys vibes, you know, the Niger vibes. Before we continue guys, please do me a favor if you haven't subscribed to this channel, please subscribe right now, click on that subscribe button and also click on the notification bell so you never miss any of my videos and also give this video a thumbs up like this video so it can get to more people and then the more people it gets to the better it is for you the better it is for me let's interact thank you and let's get right back to it by the way guys you like my outfit let me know in the comment section if you do like it you know so i know you like it though i know you like it let me know in the comment section <laughs> so today i'm going to be doing a gambia cameroon preview the match is coming up tomorrow and you know what that means you know what that means baby see cameroon has been really hot i'm just gonna get straight to it they've been hot so far in this tournament you know what i'm saying abubakar has been scoring left right center back front every like he's scored in all their games in this tournament so far you know and something's really telling me that cameroon has a higher chance of lifting this trophy of lifting the african cup of nations trophy do you guys think that do you guys agree let me know in the comment section but like i said i'll be doing a preview today and uh, we'll be taking a look at you know the matches that both teams have played so far in this tournament and how well they've done right so first of all let's talk about the the cameroonian uh team right first of all i really want to give a shout out to abubaka send abubaka for his heroics you know is wonderful play so far in the afghan he's been doing a good job like he is he's a good leader let's just put it that way scoring goals left right center let's look at um the matches so far in the tournament in the african couple of nations group stage match day one of three so Cameroon played against Burkina Faso, right? So they played against uh, Burkina Faso and um, they won 2-1. And, and of course, Vincent Abubakar scored both goals. There were penalties though. He scored one in the 48th minute and then he scored the second one in the 45th minute, like 43 plus 3, that's 48 minute, I guess. And uh, yeah, that was also a penalty, right? And uh, yeah, Burkina Faso, they scored one goal, and that was Sangari. You know, it's called in 24th minute. Okay, so that's the first game they, they played in the African Cup of Nations. The second game, right? And you guys should take note, right? I keep talking about Vincent Abubakar. He's been scoring left, right, center, front, back, everything. He's been hot. What do you want? You understand? So let's talk about the second game. In the group stage, right? So they played against Ethiopia. Four goals to one. They destroyed Ethiopia. They destroyed Ethiopia. Four goals to one. And guess who? Abubakar scored again. He scored two goals, right? And uh, this player, Carl Toko Ekambi of Cameroon, that guy has been hard to. He scored two goals in that game. You know, they really have some good strikers, man. Trust me, they have some good strikers. They have some good strikers. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so, yeah, back to it. Toko Ekambi scored in the eighth minute and he scored in the 67th minute, right? And uh, Vincent Abubakar scored in the 53rd minute and he also scored in the 55th minute. Hmm. Okay. And uh, Ethiopia, they scored one goal and that was by. Otesa in the fourth minute. So, like I said, Cameroon, they've been playing so well. That's the second game. Let's see their third game. So, their third game in the group stage was against Cape Verde. And that ended in a 1-1 draw. That ended in a 1-1 draw, right? So, um, yeah. And, of course, Abu Bakr scored again. Ah, you know, they <laughs> Abubakar scored in the in the in the Abubakar scored in the 39th minute and 
G. Rodriguez scored for Cape Verde in the 53rd minute, right? And uh, yeah, and then the first game in the round of 16. Oh, the round of 16 is just one game. So in the round of 16, they played. So in the round of 16, right, they played Comoros. Comoros ended up, a player in the team ended up getting a red card, right? And was it a player? Yeah, let's see, let's see. Yeah. So a player in the Comoros team ended up getting a red card. And of course, of course, Abu Bakr scored a game. Abu Bakr scored a game. But it was Toko Ikambi that scored the first goal. He scored in the 29th minute. Abu Bakr scored in the 78th minute. Vincent Abu Bakr. Ah, one more. That guy's hot. Abdu got a red card in the seventh minute, right? And um, Changama, Changama scored in the 81st minute for Comoros, but that wasn't enough to, um, yeah, to take them through to to um, the next stage. So Gambia, Cameroon. Let's talk about the matches that Gambia has had so far. In the group stage, the first game in the group stage of this Africa Cup of Nations, they played against Mauritania and they beat them 1-0, right? And that was Jalo that scored in the 10th minute. Fair enough. And the second game in the African Cup of Nations, they played against Mali, almighty Mali, that was kicked out yesterday by Equatorial Guinea. Sad. But anyways, they play against. <laughs> so they played against uh, Mali, and uh, they that was a draw, one one, and who scored? That was um, Barrow scored for Gambia in the 90th minute with a penalty, and it was Corney that first scored with a penalty in the 79th minute. Okay, good, good, good. Let's see. So the third game in the African Cup of Nations was against Tunisia. In that game, Tunisia ended up getting a red card one player in the tunisian team got a red card and gambia beat them by a goal to zero and that was the goal was called by ben mustafa in the 45th minute plus three minutes added to it okay 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 in the african cup of nations round of 16 they played guinea both teams right got a red card but gambia came out on top they won by a goal to zero so if we're going to actually compare the team performances so far i'm talking about between cameroon and gambia cameroon they have an upper hand they have an upper hand but don't be surprised <laughs> don't be surprised because of you know what has been going on see don't be surprised because what has been going on in the african cup of nations so far up until this moment has just been i, I would just say incredible because i would have thought that a team like gambia would get to this stage in this competition let's be honest though who would have thought that so don't be surprised if they cost an upset and they beat cameron it's possible so Cameroon shouldn't go to sleep. They should not just think, oh, yeah, it's just going to be an easy win. And then we're just going to beat Gambia and move to the next. Mm -mm. Play well. And something is telling me that Abubakar Abubaka will score you know, against Gambia, man. And something is also telling me that he would actually get that um, Ice Go Scorer Award. 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 A-W-A-R-D. Yeah. At the end of the competition. Cause he's just been scoring he's has he has six he has six goals already so hey i won't be surprised but anyways uh yeah my prediction for the game is a cameroon win cameroon will be winning that game by <sighs> but then again there have been penalties left right center man like i don't know if you guys watched that mali uh the malian game against equatorial guinea and also the um, avrico's game against um against egypt it's just been penalties 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 so do you guys think this one will end in a penalty too let me know in the comments do you think it's going to end in a penalty 
and we're going to find out. But my prediction is a win for Cameroon, though. You know what I'm saying? And that's what I'm going to see about that. But like I said, don't be surprised. Gambia, they might cause an upset. They might upset Cameroon. We're going to find out. But anyways, guys, that's what I, I have for you today. And um, thanks for rocking with me. Thanks for the love and support. I really appreciate it. Please, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do me a favor. Subscribe right now. Click on that subscribe button. And also like this video so it can go viral. You know what I'm saying? Thank you for the love and support. I really appreciate it. And leave all your comments down below. I'm going to be reading all your comments. And I'll try and reply to all of them. So please leave them in the comment section. And yeah, I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.